now for the grand reveal of the new and improved General Atomic. Wow, would you look- wait, hold on. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, we're not actually gonna use the sword, don't worry. Oh yeah, look at that though, huh? So, between this episode and last episode, I went over to Good Neighbor and purchased a shipment of very, very lovely ballistic fiber, which has allowed me to finish this beautiful new set of armor for the one and only General Atomic Planty Mush. He could put his big brain to action and, and make better, stronger, smaller, more compact power armor powered by those NPCs. And here we are with my boy. I've crafted a few more things on top of that. Whoops, that was the wrong workbench. Then we've got to wait for him to do the starting animation. And then we have to close it very painfully slowly. So with this workbench, uh, what I also noticed is not only can we make this uni belt, which adds a matching belt for the set to kind of fill in the blank areas, we were also make, able to make something called a tech mask. Do either of them do anything? Absolutely not. They are purely for aesthetic. See, the bottom half of his face is covered up now. And then we've also got the mask that closes on it too. The jetpack and everything now match color too. Uh, so we've got the jetpack from, a, I, I believe, a different mod. Uh, plus the armor, which looks very much just like the armor from Fallout uh, New Vegas and Fallout 3. Plus our fancy helmet from a different mod again. It's going very well. We've got a lot of stuff equipped. A lot of it is cosmetic. The optics prototype does technically give perception, but I am just wearing it for cosmetic reasons. This armor is obviously busted. We've got uh, the belt and the mask are very, very good. And then everything else is equipped with that T-51 power armor, giving a pretty hefty amount of defense as well. And then again, a lot of uh, cosmetic stuff too there. But all of it can have those kind of legendary misc effects. And there's our boy, Planty Mush, General Atomic himself, ready to take on the world. Today, though, we're going to go take on the bloody... Well, we're not going to take on the railroad. We're going to go help the railroad because God knows they need our help. We're going to carry on with that quest for a little while. We're trying to obviously scope out and understand all the other factions, see if the Brotherhood is worth uh, trusting, and of course see if, more importantly, the Railroad is worth trusting. Given that they have seemingly good intentions, maybe seemingly better intentions than uh, the Brotherhood, you can debate their methods, but I suppose they are trying to do a nice thing, which is free synths and give them a new life. How they go about that is very debatable, and of course everyone in the Railroad are terrible people. Desdemona seems like an idiot. Glory didn't react whatsoever to the person she was apparently terribly distraught about handing over the body to medical science to. Uh, Deacon is a drunk, drunk man who should not be given the time of day. What's happening over here? Are they those? Oh, these are these people. Those rust devils. Brotherhood up there? Who's that? Oh, just a random scavenger. Well, not anymore, you're not. Right, yes, let's get going. We've got places to go and, and things to do. We're going to hit the ground running today. Oh. You're dead. <sighs> I don't think they were hostile. I think because I aimed a gun at them, I made them hostile. Oh, I'm a terrible person. I made a horrible mistake. <laughs> oh, careful there. Hello, how are you doing? Put that out the corner of my eye. Yeah, Deacon's a drunkard, and the rest of them seem very unlikable. Like, the whole railroad. I, I don't know why, for player factions that you can join, they go out of their way to write the characters so unlikable. It seems a little bit bizarre. Where are we heading to? Um, all the way over there. Seems a little bit weird. But, hey. We're gonna, we're gonna, obviously, we're friends with a lot of synths, okay? We've got Nick, Nick Valentine, that we gave the Mantle of the Silver Shroud to. We're friends with Curie, who's technically a synth. To, to some extent, I suppose. Synth robot or oh, raider scum. <laughs> so let's not do it to help the railroad more than we're doing it to help the synths themselves. It's a much more noble reason for doing these things, I think. <laughs> we're going to do it to be charitable. Because the only reason to be charitable is when people see it. Otherwise, what's the point? Right, we're going to head over to... What is this one? The Augusta Safe House. So this is that quest that we picked up uh, yesterday, the day before. Don't entirely remember. Um, it's got a bit messy because we had the bonus episode. Now I don't remember what... Oh, dear. What episode happened when? Yeah, I think it was yesterday. They, they told us about it. I, I think it was Dr. Carrington told us about it while we were there. More specifically, it was incredibly rude to us while we were helping out the, uh, the railroad. You know... As everyone is in this game. Curie, how did you get under there? What the hell's coming into attacks now? A, a swarm of bloat flies. Let's just go indoors. Well, let's be careful. Because I assume there are synths. Given that they lost contact with this place. 
Let's see what we've got going on here. Oh, was that a raider? It's either a raider or a very angry dog. Ruff. No, that's a raider for sure. A lot requires terminal. Okay. That I will. General Atomic. Away. Oh. Hello. That's not a synth. Unless. Oh, that would be genius. The Institute build synths in the shape of raiders. And then they can attack places like Diamond City or the Brotherhood. Why don't they do that? Am I missing something? Maybe it takes a lot of money and effort and cost to build the tier 3 synths. Compared to the tier 2 synths. Otherwise, they could just get a bunch of tier 3 synths, dress them up as raiders, and have them go and attack civilian settlements, and then be like, oh, it wasn't us. It wasn't us, Stinky. It was those damn raiders again. In fact, that's like the biggest opportunity of having people whose appearance can change. I feel like they're missing a... Missing an advantage there. Not enough synths undercover. <laughs> they should make the mayor. They should have made the mayor of um, Diamond City a synth. That would have made sense. You know, I think the institute's not really that bad. Piper should have been a synth. They should have replaced her. She could have printed an article. Local press confused about friendliness of institute. Really just like low IQ plays from Kuro there. We've been spotted, she says, while ablaze. It's just very frustrating. Robotic hyperintelligence combined with uh, an artificial human. You'd assume she'd be slightly more um, cognizant of anything at all. <laughs> We've got to go through here then. Oh, the lanterns. Right, follow the lanterns. Oh, there's another lantern there. Follow the... Uh, is it plausible that the Raiders might just not want to be in the dark? Yeah, of course. Is it plausible that this could be the symbol of the railroad and we have to follow them? Uh, yes, very plausible indeed. Is that, does that count as a lantern? The big flaming bin? Does that count as a lantern? I feel like this is a dead end. Oh, there are synths here, though. Uh. I feel like this is probably not the right way. Uh. There is an elevator. There's no lantern. How am I supposed to know if I'm going in the right direction? Oh, hello. Was that me? Oh, dear. Probably with the good guy. We can't even leave calling cards anymore to let the wasteland know that it was... Oh! Unkillable Woofty was just bisected, but it's okay. She's called that for a reason. Sixth floor. Sixth floor. I presume we're going in the right direction. The map marker is saying we're not, but... Don't never believe it's lies. These Bethesda games, they like to, uh, they like to mislead you and send you on a wild goose chase. One of the Bethesda games I played recently sent me on a wild goose chase uh, where I was a miner and then I like got in a spaceship and then I thought I was having fun, but I wasn't. It's crazy. It was a real wild goose chase. The destination was enjoyment, but I never quite got there. Oh, there's the map marker. Okay, so we're definitely going in the right direction then. Uh, hello? I think we could shoot one through that. <laughs> through the gap in the wall. Let's be honest. The projectile is just going to hit the wall anyway. I still feel good, yeah. I mean, that's kind of rhetorical, because... No. Ow! I'm not going to play it until the mods are out anyway, so... What the fuck was that? Villain! <laughs> Fucking hell. Right, let's try that again. Okay, there you go. Good work. Heal again. Heal again. I thought we were out of stim packs then. <laughs> Smashing the heal button, it wasn't happening. Whoa, this is a cool. Whoa, this is cool. God damn, it's like Raider City. Presume the railroad built this and uh, things didn't end too well. This reminds me of the level in Demon Souls. Uh, which one is it? Like World 4, World 5, the swampy world? You know the bit I mean. Like right at the start where you have to climb down the. You frantically climb down the. Um, loads of drops to quickly rush down the blessed mace at the beginning so that you can get a good early starting game weapon and then in the process die a hundred times and change your world tendency to black you know the one i'm talking about not speaking from recent experience <laughs> right i don't know if we're going the right way but it seems about that sorry i'm whipping the camera around so much just on high alert you know just on very high alert we're here to save save the day that can't wait, I'm afraid. 
Good low. I'm gonna lower the camera sensitivity. I'll let you know if that helps out, or let me know if that helps out. I'll let you know if it makes it worse for me. Um, look sensitivity. Let's do that. Is that like unplayable? That's better. That's fine. I can certainly, I can certainly adapt to this. I'm gonna be a shit shot for a while. But please let me know if that is uh, slightly more watchable because it should be slightly smoother. Rather than me whipping and panning around nonstop. What? There's a door here. Is someone seriously asleep in here? Oh. Hello? Really just telegraph your attacks more. I almost missed the fact that you were winding up to hit me then. You were so fast. Okay, well that's where we're supposed to go, right there. We could just always... I may have detected enemies, she was about to say. She, she's just not... Oh, office key, hello. She's not the smartest tool in the shed. Even though she was a literal robot at one point. Lovely beer bottles, thank you. What have we got for me? Machine gun turret is all out of order. Very good. Okay. Oh! Right, let's, let's figure out what's wrong with them here, Doc. So that looks like, um... Yep, that's not good at all. Firstly, they appear to have two sets of teeth. Is that an x-ray of a child, then? Look. Very bizarre. Uh, what's going on with their spine? Hard to tell, really. These are terrible x-rays. Uh, spine is... Oh, look, they've got a... They've got a they've got some sort of, like, uh... What's the word? Curvy, curvy spine syndrome. I can't remember the word for it. I'm not an actual doctor, I'm afraid. So, I mean, I don't know why I'd be expected to know the word for it. Curvy spine syndrome. I keep wanting to say osteoporosis, but that's not right. Along the right lines, but definitely not that. How the fuck did we get over there, then? Away! This is a legendary item, then, I assume, and not actually... Ah, oh, there it is. That's what we were actually after. Pull back to Dr. Carrington. How did I miss that? I literally walked right past it. Oh, this place goes deep, huh? Wait, is this the bottom floor? No, it's not. It's like still totally different again. This is crazy. This place is enormous. What the hell? <laughs> okay, maybe I'm overshooting that very slightly. Oh, he was in the piss arena. I just killed the man. You didn't just kill the man in the urinal. It's very rude. Like the video game, uh, Fahrenheit. Indigo Prophecy, as you would know it in America. It's called Fahrenheit over here. Or where am I getting that backwards? No, I think it was called Fahrenheit here. Because if Americans saw a game called Fahrenheit, they might confuse it for the temperature and that would throw them right off. Because then they see the 18 on the case and they'd be like, oh, oh, it's so cold outside. It's 18 degrees Fahrenheit cold. Oh, hello. Shit the bed. We're not in power armor this time. Bloody hell. That came from nowhere. So yeah, you have to call it Indigo Prophecy in the US, as far as I recall. Let's turn the circuit breaker on. What the hell does that do for us? Any idea? Activates an elevator to get us out? Oh, let's just open the door. Right. Fair enough. Boop. Okay. Got free fusion core. Fusion cores are probably going to be saving at this point, to be honest, because we're effectively wearing power armor anyway. Fusion cores I'll probably save to... Oh. Oh, dear. The Raiders were making them fight the death core. Clapper. Yeah, we'll probably save the fusion cells to just convert into ammo at this point instead. <gasps> sea Captain's hat, you what? Hello there. Call me Captain Atomic. I was getting a little bit too close to one. Um... Hold on, what does it look like? Oh, no, it's not that type of Captain hat. Oh, no, that's like Hello Sailor, not like Yar Sailor. That's the wrong type. Hold on. There you go. Better. Now, we, now we're now we over encumbered? Oh, because I've been a fucking inventory and the also loot items got added in. Uh, Mistress of Mystery. For you, I have time. Thank you. You're the second person to tell me that. Very weird. Um, I, I need to give you something. No. Uh, no, no, no. Anything you want to talk oh, about? My systems are eager. Great. Uh, that was it. As you wish. No, I need to give you something. Command. No, fuck me. Command. May I no, don't you? like... No, 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 sorry. That, that were unrelated. I can't As give her say. stuff. I don't know why it's not working. Oh, well. Is it because my gun's out? Come on. I am happy to help. Nope, not working. All right, whatever. Ball for Woofty. Oh, Woofty, don't run. Don't run. Don't run. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Do good, good dog. There you go. Right. Uh, here, take some weight. I don't know what the hell we picked up that's so goddamn heavy. Uh, let's see, Captain's hat. Push us over the edge. Uh, then what else we got here? 
We're using that as my as my only weapon. We should probably go to, go to that vault at some point sooner rather than later. And uh, what the fuck have I picked up? Just did loads of NPCs or something? Oh yeah, we got a lot. To be fair, we need some for teleportation. Well, we got 15 still. Not that I'm using the teleportation very effectively. Oh Jesus, we are getting ratted up. Now, if I'm not mistaken, the torso piece on this power armor has a uh, rag cleansing. We'll see how effective it is. I won't use it right away, and we'll see how long, realistically, it takes for us to, like, practically, it takes for us to clear all those rats. Well, that's so radical. Door barred. Listen, I've got some fucking news for you. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Uh, where did it just go? Oh, there it is. Wow, I cannot hit a bloody thing. Business as usual, really. It's all right. Curie has, um... Beyond military grade weaponry. Don't know what you call that. Exceptionally high powered, perhaps ridiculously so firearms. Experimental Institute Tech. Probably some stuff around here that's going to stop us fast traveling. Beautiful shot. Thank you, Planty. Well, something's pissed her off. <laughs> no idea what she's firing at, though. Oh, is our blood bug up there? Great. Right. In theory, that is that. We can go back to the railroad, for better or worse. And now we can be talked down to and condescended by a bunch of volunteers trying to do a good thing. Tom wants you for something. Tom wants me for something, does he? Fucking Tom can wait. But yes, Doc Carrington is going to stand up and immediately deride me. Oh, skipped over all his dialogue. What a terrible shame I don't get to hear myself being insulted. No oh, fucking wasteland is fire me. It's as I feared. Three safe houses gone. Hard to imagine. You have to imagine. I have nothing further for you at the moment. Okay. I'm sure someone else could use your help. No shortage of files to be put out. Uh, thank you, uh, doctor. We've completed Butcher's Bill. Oh. Confirmed. Uh, Pam. Agent Professor has arrived. Agent Professor. I have a mission for you. Okay, Pam. increasing efficiency of synth traffic flow... Parts of entire organization being compromised increase daily. Solution: a new distribution center needs to be established. That oh, sounds good. Uh, uh, give me the details. Pacify the target location. Fortify position to protect current and future railroad assets. New distribution center will be codenamed Mercer Safe House. Mercer Safe good House. Luck. Right, beautiful. Okay, we can do that. That's absolutely fine. Okay, thank you, Pam. Much obliged. I guess we'll go. I guess we we'll go work on that. Oh, look, all the rats are already gone. The importance uh, hello. of Bunker Hill and our asset there is not widely known. Please keep it that way. Uh, hello. God damn it! Losing Augusta is a real blow. Not your. Do you have any jobs no. for me? Good work on Augusta. Uh-huh. I'd rather know the hard Right, truth. okay, so she's just gonna repeat herself about Augusta then. Uh anyone else that we can have a chat with? A drummer boy said a lot of Tom's looking right. for you. Who is Tom? Where is Tom? Why is Tom? Where the fuck is anyone? Where do you people go? Oh, Tom? No? Tom? No? Can be a bigger problem than even the they all sleep like out here, right? No? Ah, Tom? Glory. You know what? We're just gonna move on. <laughs> <laughs> We're just going to move on with this Christ, I think. It's on it. Uh, secure Krupp Manor and use the workshop. Oh, is this just radiant stuff like bloody Preston Garvey? Oh, okay. I've already secured this, but this was the one with the ghoul in the basement. Oh my god, that's another quest of a ghoul being 200 years in a fucking basement. Ah! Oh, Bethesda. Do you know how long 200 years is? You know the chance of like, anybody surviving 200 years, let alone a bloody ghoul or whatever. Is that another ghoul? I hope that was a ghoul, because I just shot it in the head. It was. That's good. It makes me feel a little bit better about the situation. Have I got to clear these out first? Because you can't use the what? I'm going to say, you can't use a workbench while there are enemies nearby, can you? Okay, that can be tipped over, because that's terrifying. The bike. I have no patience for that. Honestly, that's the type of thing I do post-apocalyptic ways, and I start putting mannequins looking out of windows just to fuck people over. Just to scare the life out of them. It's exceptionally cruel. There's absolutely no reason for it, but... You know, it's honest work. 
someone has to. Someone has to make that sacrifice. Okay, that's it then. We just go bang. There you go. Boom. Okay. Build defenses. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, for God's sake. Is that all these quests are going to be? You just pop around and build bloody turrets everywhere. Here. Gears? Where do I get gears from? Uh, I was going to say, we can break the whole mansion now. That's hilarious. I'm not going to do that, but we could. Gears, 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 gears and that. Gears and that. Scrap, scrap, garbage, crap, crap, nonsense, rubbish. Okay. Uh, Where'd you get gears? Oh, there's a verse bird over there. Well, that inevitably crashes into us. Oh, no, it's actually, look at that. It's actually landing. Colour me shocked. Right. Um, oh, motorbike will have gears. Did it have gears? It did not have gears. Fuck me. What, what type of turret can I build with what I've got? I'm not, I don't really want to piss around doing building today. I don't really want to do building today. That wasn't really what I signed up for. I did a load of building yesterday. Oh, that will have gears. Death line. It does not. It does not have gears. <laughs> uh... Well, I'm all out of ideas. Oh, no. Would you look at that? Right. We'll deal with that another day. Thank you. Right. Uh, meet with Elder Max. And I don't think I've got the patience for him either. I don't think I've got the patience for any of these people. Talk to Hancock. That seems like a good quest to go and do. That seems like a good quest to go and do. Talk to Hancock. Yeah. Um, search. Let's, let's tick off some of these then. Yeah. Look for the laser for Chestnut Hillock Reservoir. Okay. Let's get the Museum of Witchcraft. Let's just do all of these. Let's do some side quests today. It's been a weird point where we might end up going too much into the Brotherhood or too much into... I've been to Walden Pond. Oh, okay. We'll go from Gorski Cabin. Oh, I know. We, we tick this off and this is the where I was going and we fought old Ahab and I got rocked like three or four times by it because it's a ridiculous modded creature with a tremendous power. Okay, we want to go to this one. Apparently, we can go indoors here at this pond. Well, this might lead to something more interesting than just... Fishing caps out of the water. What is that? It was a bloody ghoul. Go away. Great shot. Oh, I think it might be a... Oh, yeah. Here they come. Great visual. Some sprinting out of the undergrowth. I like that. The zombie games do more of that, huh? Right, where are you? Terrible bloody miles away. Let's not worry about that one. <laughs> I think Planty will probably turn into a feral ghoul by the time we... By the time we wait for that friggin' thing. There you go. It is I, uh, General Atomic, di distributing justice by shooting people in their sleep. Oh, dear. Is it actually cut heading over here? It's still on the bloody map. Right, let's get going. Gorski Pond? Walden Pond. Gorski Cabin. There's another Super Mutant Behemoth in here. I'm telling you, I'm going to be pissed. Okay, we can just... Fly, cliff racer, fly. Wait, what are we looking for? I guess we've only got to go indoors. Okay. Stash of caps in here, in a drainage pipe. You didn't say that. You said you said you said the pond. You said Walden Pond. No one will hear us coming. It's fine. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, there are raiders. Ooh, there are raiders. Don't you die on me. Lots of raiders. This is good. Wasn't expecting that when we came in. Hello. Tales of a jerky town vendor. Better prices. That's great, because that's what we need. Bear in mind, still trying to save up 10,000 caps so that we can use the other, other, other cybernetics mod. Not the cybernetics mod you put the implant in. Not the cybernetics mod where you uh, build this armor. This cybernetics mod, but the other other cybernetics mod that let you use Kellogg cybernetics. <laughs> Hello, what have you got for me? Wow, really? We can't just unlock it. Hmm, can't find that. Ah, there it is. Careful. Fuck. Damn you. Damn you to hell. Which game was it that let you save your lockpick position? Was that Skyrim? Maybe. Could have been Starfield. Ooh, duct tape. We love some ducks tape. Right, let's grab all this shit. Should probably pick up all these tools and then go to the vault and sell them and use that money to buy the books. I feel like we probably picked up quite a lot. Oh, we got the key to the gift shop. It's, it's ours now. Keys to the actual kingdom. Oh, Big Jim. 20% chance to cripple the target's leg. Thank you, Big Jim. Much obliged. <laughs> big fucking Jim. What the hell? 
We can get all the stuffed toys we could ever want. Walden Pond gift shop. Let's go and have a look. Name your favorite stuffed toy. Everyone's going to say Blahaj. I know that's not how that's pronounced. I know how it's pronounced. I'm just going to refuse to give you that credit. I don't respect Swedish. It's a made-up language. By troglodytes. They've spent far too much time near the water. And their fish have pickled their brain. Dunkle Scotch. Might actually be the superior. I'm going to say it. It's going to offend a lot of people. The superior Ikea stuffed toy. You can go look that up. Where the fuck are we going? <laughs> Is that it? Was that the, that, was the, that, was the, that was the encounter? That was the miscellaneous quest. Okay. Um, oh. We're going to the laser. God, we're going to a lot of fucking reservoirs and lakes and shit to go and grab some miscellaneous junk, aren't we? I don't even remember who sent us to come and get this laser at this point. They probably died three weeks ago. I was going to buy the dog a Dunkle Scotch, and then I realized, uh, my, firstly, my closest Ikea is far too far away for me to give a shit. And then secondly, Ikea stuffed toys are very expensive. How much money alone do you think the shark brings in? Probably a small fortune. That's probably revolutionized their... Probably absolutely revolutionized their income, hasn't it? People can't afford their low-quality bric-a-brac furniture. Good lord, do you want to take any longer to reload that gun there, big man? If only I aim down sight, I might actually hit something a bit more frequently. I'm really surprised they haven't cashed in on it, now that I think about it. I'm surprised they haven't done a whole range of, like, collectible different sharks. Same color scheme. Obviously, you've got to keep the color scheme, right? That's the iconic part. Did you say the dead should be handled more carefully than that? What do they do? What, do I walk over a skeleton? But you could have, like, one in, like, a hat. You could give one long, stripy socks. That one would sell well. They should put me in charge of that. What if I do that? I, just, I electrocute Curry. That's what happens. They should put me in charge of their marketing department. Right. I think this is what we're after. Careful, careful, careful. Te oh, te tease it. So, uh. Okay, hold on. See, you don't need a mod to put the lockpit back in the right place if you just remember where the lockpit was. It's actually kind of crazy. Ooh, caps. My favorite part about all the Fallout NPCs uh, it is their... Play tape. Okay, go on then. Is their obsession with cleanliness post-apocalypse? Pull that weapon. Why? We're under attack. What's happening? She just, just randomly pulled out a gun. Oh, we're near the vault. Let's go over there before I forget again. It's like right here. So let's pop over and buy that bloody gun I keep threatening to buy. We could sell some stuff. We probably picked up some stuff on adventure. We take the NPCs off the dog. We sell those. What is that? Nuka Coley. Mm. Oh. Cricket. Better buy my big guns now because you bet your ass your enemies will. Uh, okay. Guns, guns, and more guns. Just for you. I can fix her. What, you, what have you got? What have you got here? Uh, super value. Spray and pray. Bullets explode on impact doing 15 points very effect damage. That sounds really, really, really good. Is that not really good? That sounds really good. I'm gonna buy that. How much is it? 2,000 credits. You got yourself a deal. That sounds really good. Okay. Um, I'll trade you like those for them. I'm sure I've picked up a load of crap that I'm just like not using. Value. Here. Um, to keep the meat, because I'm gonna, I'll, I'll cook those and then we can sell them for more. I'm not eating food, so why am I keeping it? <coughs> Do I need 214 purified water? You bet your ass I don't. So let's go ahead and sell all this crap. Kapow. Um, you know what? Let's sell 50 more. You know what? Let's just sell like another 69 more because I'm not going to use that. Yeah, you can you can just have like all almost all of my water. Um, sell yeah any cooked food because I'm not I'm not using it right. We don't need it, so you might as well just sell it and then I'll cook the rest up. Don't sell the mute fruit for God's sake. We need that shit. That's the one that we actually do need. Boom, some delicious grilled radroach. Enjoy this moldy food that apparently she wants to buy. Oh, no, 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 tell, tell, tell the carrots. You know what, carrots aren't important. Right, we've got anything else to sell. Um, these things with just, like, this symbol next to it. Like, a gold bar isn't used for junk, even though we were lacking gold at one point. Which I don't understand, personally, but hey. I guess we'd just sell it then, huh? Like, silver bars, copper bars, do we just sell that? I'm not going to sell it, just in case I'm wrong. Please let me know in the comments below. Uh, sell some fusion cores, good lord. We need to build a weapon that uses fusion cores. I'm not going to use mini nukes. 
Uh, no, but I might one day for a laugh. So let's keep that. Um, oh, the alcohols. Yeah, we don't. Oh, no, my new, oh, my Sony Pops. No, can I have those back? We need those. Let's sell some beer. Beer it is. There you go. Oh, no, keep the notes. Keep the Sony Pops. Uh, right, that's all good. We don't use Psycho or any sort of, um, you know, medically negative drugs. Day Tripper? Is that addictive? That seems addictive. Plus three luck, though. Fucking hell. I should have popped one of those before we sold all this stuff, because then we get extra. We don't need damage resistance. There you go. Uh, boom. Burn on trying to keep 10,000 credits for, as I said, the uh, thingy, thingy, uh, thingy uh, we talked about before. It's very late at night. I'm losing my mind. Spray and pray. This seems really good. And then if I take the bloody suppressor off of that, because I sure as hell don't need it, and we upgrade the actual gun itself, better receiver, like powerful receiver, better uh, hair trigger, whatever. That seems like that could be really, really, really good. I don't like automatic weapons. I like a careful shot place well. However, however, <laughs> just like steal all their shit. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Let's go and nick all this stuff. I I think that's that's like that, that seems like pretty fun though. Just firing explosive shots. Right off we go. Track down whatever bloody shop this is. I don't know which one it is. I think it was just the general store, right? Someone gave me those uh, Eldritch directions before. Kiri hasn't mentioned anything about being back in the vault either. Which is very bizarre. I feel like she would just mention it. Ah, oh, here I am back home or something like that. Right. Uh, it was commissary. Over here around the corner and then... Uh, Hello. Get fucking robbed. <laughs> <laughs> Bear in mind, the auto loot mod does not allow you to steal anything, to, to pick up anything that counts as stealing. So this is all stuff that we are allowed to take. I guess because we've done so much for the vault, they're just happy to let us um rob the entire commissary. That seems a bit far. I mean, if it wasn't for us, they wouldn't even have a vault, so that's kind of fair. Right, let's hang around for a few hours. When, do, when does the shop open these days? I haven't left my house in six months. The shop's open at like in like noon, right? That's when that's when normal people wake up, something like that. Now, oh Jesus, you're already open. In my pocket. I mean, uh, hello. Looking for something? I have more stuff than I know what to do with. Not anymore, you don't. Let's see what you've got. Great. I have all sorts of odds. God, look at him. He's so powerful. So so commanding. Overseer's Guardian. That's it. That's the one you were talking about. Three thousand dollar reduce. Uh well, let's see if we can sell something. Hold on. Uh value overweight. Uh pack of chem cigarettes. I'm gonna use that. Uh Ah, shit. <laughs> Sell those. We're not going to use those. Oh, I'm supposed to be saving money. This is the opposite of saving money. Are we ever going to use Big Jim? It sells for 26. The effect chip is worth way... She doesn't buy fucking shit for anything. Look at this. You rip off, lady. You rip off. Okay, whatever. Just give me that. I'll go scrounge up some more caps, I'm sure. It's a direct upgrade to the gun we've got. It's got two shot, which people keep saying is like the best thing going. So, um, there it is. Overseas Guardian. And we could put the same conversion... That we've got on this, on that. Because it's just, it's just the same thing. We can do so many upgrades on that. Ooh. That's fun. I think we're also out of NPCs. You saw the relay started to tick down there. So let's go back to uh, our brand new hidden secret bunker base. Which I think, I'm sorry to say this, might be slightly bugged. It took me about six or seven attempts for the game to load in. Never has done that before. The mod pack has never changed. Up until I added. To make another steam pack soon? Just, how are you making those? You were a robot before. I can understand he's storing chemicals in you. To be fair, she could still be storing chemicals in her. I'm not going to ask. Still until I added the um, island mod, it always loaded fine. First time, no issues, no errors. Now I've added that. It took me like six or seven attempts to load and it just kept crashing. I could have checked the log. And I was like, no, I'm just going to keep doing it because I haven't changed anything. And it worked. So who's right now? Why do a problem now when you can put it off and put it off and put it off? That's my life advice to you all. Okay. So, let's go back to, uh, was it Sanctuary, Settlement Island, Sanctuary Island, what the hell's here? Hello? Something we've got to kill before we get this bloody Yaogwai. Oh, that seems pretty good. <laughs> Doesn't that seem good? Oh! Recover the laser. Oh my god, we didn't even do it. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, let's tidy this up fast. I've literally got to go in like two minutes. We're going to cut this episode short today. I'm going to put the dog to bed and I'm keeping her awake for the purpose of this. Real life Mabel Borf Woofty herself. 
As I'm keeping her awake for this nonsense. Here. Grab it. Grab that. Grab that. Grab, 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 go. Okay, and back up. And can we fast travel from the water? You cannot fast travel while taking radiation damage. You say that and I'll lose my mind Who while there are enemies the nearby. Is oh, it's a bunch of fucking bloody friggin' sting wings and bloat flying crap. Jesus. Piss off. You're doing real life damage to poor sweet Borf Woofty. Right, there's another one right there. <laughs> right, we're almost done. We're almost done. Ow! We're almost done. Okay. Right, sorry. Yes, let's go customize this gun fast and let's wrap it up here for today. Slightly shorter episode, but you did also get like two hours of Fallout yesterday, so you can shove it right up your ass. <laughs> and we were more productive today than we are in most of the episodes because we hit the ground running. I guess we will do a little bit more for the Brotherhood. A lot of people said do a bit more for the Brotherhood. Obviously, we'll have to part ways with Curie because we can't take her to the Brotherhood. If they found out she's a synth, and I'm sure they would know immediately if they had a synth in their presence, right? They're the Brotherhood of Steel. They're, they're military. They're well organized. They would know immediately if there was a if there was a synth hanging around. Right. Ooh. You know we're going to do it. I'm going to type to 308. I've got so much of that. How can I not? Um, long ported barrel. Yes, please. Uh, that we've got that on there. Let's do the plasma conversion for extra damage. That way we've got a different ammo type. Good shit. We can have that and that other conversion too, which is bizarre, I will admit. Um, can we have like a medium scope? I don't want any scope. It's scopes I find so slow. Just put like a fucking yeah, uh, sight on it. Boom. And for the muzzle, whatever gives us <gasps> Zeta charge. Cryo charge again. Yes, that's right. That's right. That's right. Then we can break apart the old one that we were using, which was uh, somewhere here, I'm sure. Ah, this one. This one. This one. Goodbye, combat rifle. That's definitely the right one. Boom. There it goes. Rid of that. Did we have to do something with that laser rifle? Was that just like quest complete when we did that? And then this thing we've got to keep as well. You know we've got to keep this. Tommy Ice Receiver. Uh, change the ammo type, which we don't have, unfortunately. Let's do that. Uh, quicker Jet Drum is on there. Reflex Sights, sure. Uh, take the suppressor. I'll put a cryo charger on there. That's insidious. That's ridiculous. Explosive freezing bullets. Beautiful time. That's that one sorted. Big Jim. No, thank you. So what do you gym these nuts? And then let's get rid of that plasma rifle. Because we're using plasma bullets in this. Beautiful. That, my friends, is some upgrades. Thank you for the advice on that one, too. That's, uh, that's very, very helpful. Saved us a bunch of effect chips. Thank you for joining Planty Mush the Silver Shroud. We'll be back tomorrow to do a bit more Brotherhood against my better judgment.